On this week's episode, we're meeting up with Butch Patrick, who played Eddie in the 1960s hit TV show, The Munsters. We'll also get to see Laura Wimbles, who is Lenora from Saturday Night's The Big Bad B-Movie Show. And if that's not enough to get you excited, we'll also be taking a ride aboard The Munster Coach, right alongside Butch Patrick himself at the helm. So please, join us for this monstrous occasion. It's bound to be a ghoulish good time, right here on History and Relics. Today, we're at Carol and John's Comic Book Shop on Lorraine Avenue in Cleveland, Ohio, for a special event that they're hosting in conjunction with the Cleveland Hot Club. The special event is a meet and greet with none other than Butch Patrick, the actor who played Eddie in the 1960s hit TV show, The Munsters. We'll also be meeting Laura Wimbles, who is Lenora on Saturday night's Big Bad B-Movie show on Channel 43. Butch, born Patrick Allen Lilly, was born on August 2, 1953 in California, and by the age of eight made his film debut in The Two Little Bears. He went on to appear in numerous roles in many TV series such as Ben Casey, Bonanza, My Favorite Martian, Mr. Ed, and many more. But his life changed in 1964 when he landed the role of Eddie Munster, a child werewolf for the soon-to-be iconic TV show, The Munsters. He starred alongside his TV parents, Fred Gwynn and Yvonne DiCarlo, who portrayed a Frankenstein and vampire type characters as Herman and Lily Munster. They were joined by Al Lewis as Grandpa, a Count Dracula of sorts, and Pat Priest as Lily's niece, Marilyn, a rather normal individual, well, to us anyway. The Munsters only ran for two seasons, from 1964 to 1966, but with about 70 episodes have continued running in syndication now for over five decades. There are now generations of people who have come to know and love this crazy spooky family living at 1313 Mockingbird Lane. Butch has continued acting and appearing in several movies and TV shows, from Scary Movie to The Simpsons, and even has a role as the Tin Can Man in Rob Zombie's upcoming reboot of the Munsters. In the spirit of the ghoulish fictional characters such as Goularty, Son of Ghoul, Superhost, and of course, the Mistress of the Dark, Elvira, let us introduce you to actress, storyteller, and photographer, Laura Wimbles, who is Lenora on the Big Bad B-Movie show that airs on Saturday nights here in Cleveland on Channel 43 opposite Zach Durr. Like their predecessors, this show offers up comedic sketches and cinematic trivia while featuring a truly B-flick that, for whatever reason, you just can't turn away from. And with every great show, you have to have a great set of wheels too, right? And that's just what Butch Patrick brought here as well today, his replica-built Munster Coach that was built by Rucker Posey. Take a look.
Butch's car was made in honor of the original as built by Hollywood's king of the customizers, George Barris. Barris used a sketch drawn up by Tom Daniel and together with Dick and Keith Dean created the coach using three Model Ts. When it was done, after more than 500 man hours, it sported six doors and measured out to be 18 feet long on a custom handmade frame. It was powered by a Ford 289 Cobra engine that had a four-speed manual transmission. The original cost to build the coach in 1964 was about $18,000 and was Barris's first car on television. It debuted in Season 1, Episode 4 of The Munsters and was given to Herman from Lily as a birthday present. Barris also made Grandpa's Dragula for the show too, but went on to make other classic TV cars such as the original Batmobile, the Beverly Hillbillies truck, and Kit, just to name a few. The original Munster coach, though, can now be seen at the Volo Auto Museum in Volo, Illinois. All right, it's about that time. Time to hop aboard the Munster coach and have Butch Patrick take us for a spin. This is going to be an experience like no other. So come on, what are you waiting for? Get in and let's ride.
Man, was that great. I can't even put it into words. But let's take a few minutes to watch some of the others here take their rides and get their reactions. Fantastic! What a great experience! And we're so happy that you could join us today and share in this excitement. We would like to send a special thanks out to Carol and John's Comic Book Shop and the Cleveland Haunt Club for hosting this great event. For more information on Carol and John's Comic Book Shop, whether it's for new comics, vintage, golden age, silver age, or supplies, check them out on Facebook as well as at www.cnjcomics.com. Dot com. Lastly, we'd like to thank Butch Patrick and Laura Wimbles for being so gracious today and especially to Butch for the awesome ride of a lifetime in his Munster coach. Thank you for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed our program. If you like our content, we ask that you give us a thumbs up, a like, share with your friends, subscribe to our channel, and ring that notification bell 
so you always know when our new content is published. And all of this costs nothing, but means a lot to us and keeps us growing. You may also leave us a tip if you choose. The address is provided here on your screen, and a link is provided in the description area below. So until next time, everyone, this one is history. Hey, and be sure to check out our eBay store under ID, History, and Relics. We're now featuring channel merchandise, starting with our new logo magnet. They're only $5.50, and net proceeds go towards supporting our channel.